New at 530, one guy in Volusia County has a new neighbor tonight. It's one who likes to hang from trees. We're talking about a monkey here, and a curious one at that. News Six's Lauren Korn shows us pictures of the primate and spoke to the homeowner about his new friend. Tucked deep in the woods and off the grid along the St. Johns River is where Lee Young has lived for the last seven years. I see everything. If it moves, I see it. And recently, Young, who goes by Captain Lee, spotted this monkey who appears to be a rhesus macaque that likes to hang in trees and on the snail shell covered grounds. He's uh, about 30 pounds and he's a reddish color over his back. He's kind of a grayish color on his shoulders and his right front four, and then he's white in his belly. A timid monkey who Captain Lee says only appears in the mornings and early evenings and was already gone by the time we got there. I enjoy taking pictures of him and I'm gonna leave him alone. I mean, he's on the other side of the canal from me. Captain Lee showed us several pictures of the monkey who he's named George. George is a jungle. And believes George traveled alone from Silver Springs State Park. Because he was probably a part of another troop and then he got out and He's been looking for another troop. <laughs> he's looking for a girl. I know that he's an invasive species, but he's not an aggressive animal. Or poses a threat to him and his wife and says he does not want anyone to find George unless he wants to be found. Here's a new neighbor. I see millions of gators. I see millions of wading birds and everything else out here. So to see a monkey is quite a, quite a treat. Somewhere in DeBerry, Lauren Korn, News 6. Somewhere in DeBerry. Yeah, he caught yeah. some good pictures there. Yeah, he did.